Well, Metro North ridership is at an all time post pandemic high with 4.8 million riders last month. And New York Senator Chuck Schumer says it's time to improve rail safety for commuters and drivers. And News 12's Karen Pinto was at the Manitou train station in Phillipstown in Putnam County, where the, the senator announced his two track plan. Safety is my foremost responsibility for these people to make sure that they can get to, to work safely, that they can come home. And unfortunately, my husband didn't have that opportunity to come home. Nancy Montgomery's husband, Jim Lovell, was one of four killed when a Metro North train derailed in Spite and Dival in 2013. <laughs> First, Schumer announced he secured funding to improve railroad grade crossings in Putnam, Dutchess, and Westchester. The funding will upgrade the warning systems, boost accessibility, help Metro North implement other safety measures on Hudson and Harlem lines. Eliminating dangerous crossings is something MTA board member Neil Zuckerman says the area needs. The one in Westchester and Peekskill actually has a 1.6 chance out of 1,000 of an accident. FRA grades them all, and it's a really frightening one. Secondly, Senator Schumer calls for massive infrastructure upgrades. Through the bipartisan infrastructure bill, Senator Schumer says there is money in the federal budget for rail safety funding programs, such as positive train control. We all know what PTC is by now. It's a signaling system that just causes a train when they're approaching a car that's on the tracks, that's stuck on the tracks, to just stop. Montgomery hopes these efforts will save lives. This is the lifeline to our well-being, and, and we, we need it, and we need it to work for us. In Putnam County, Karen Pinto, News 12. Improvements in grade crossings in Putnam and Dutchess will begin right away with Westchester grade crossings starting a little bit later.